Hello everyone, welcome to Vishesh Educational Videos. In this video, I am explaining about different types of robotics process automation platforms. That means platforms that can be used to automate your processes, right? If you are not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. To get the notification of my new videos, please click the bell icon. If you want to know more about RPA, I provided the link in the description section. So it is going to give a brief introduction about RPA, right? So you can go through it. Now I am going to explain what are the different types of platforms, RPA platforms, right? That can be used to automate your process, okay? So first platform is Automation Anywhere. So the, this platform automation anywhere, it helps to automate business processes for companies. Especially they, they focus on RPA, that is robotics process automation, cognitive data, right? Especially to automate the process related to machine learning and the natural language processing. And also you can automate business analytics. So automation anywhere concentrate mainly on these uh, areas. And their bots are capable of handling both structured and uh, as well as unstructured data, right? Both type of data that uh, can be taken care by their bots, that is uh, bots that are provided by automation anywhere. So their system, so automation anywhere uh, platform system has three basic components. So uh, first component is uh, development client for creation of a bot, so right? So to create your virtual robo, you, are, uh, you have a development client using that you can create your robo. And the second component is runtime environment for the deployment of a bot. Once the robo is uh, developed, it should be deployed in the particular environment, right? So to support that automation anywhere, grow, uh, automation anywhere, right, is, uh, is going to provide a runtime environment. And the last component is a centralized command system, right? Why I need a centralized command system? It is mainly used for handling multiple robots, right? So you can create multiple robots, right? So you can uh, create multiple robots and also you can analyze their performance. For that purpose, I am using centralized command system. So Automation Anywhere is a company that provides a platform to automate business processes for companies and the second one is very popular uh, uh, platform that is UiPath so in the coming videos whatever the automation related tasks I am going to explain uh, all those tasks are done in UiPath studio especially UiPath platform right it is very popular platform actually for uh, robotics process automation so UiPath is an RPA technology vendor who designs and delivers software that helps automate businesses. Uh, this UiPath is also mainly concentrating on automating the business processes. Here uh, is in the same way as automation anywhere, RPA platform also con consists of three parts. Uh, one is UiPath Studio to design the processes. UiPath robot to automate the tasks designed in UiPath Studio. So UiPath Studio is mainly used to design the uh, right uh, processes. When once the processes are created in UiPath Studio, that can be uh, automated in UiPath robot. And UiPath right. UiPath orchestrator to run and manage the processes. Getting my point? UiPath Studio is used to design the processes. UiPath Robo is used to automate your processes that is created in UiPath Studio. UiPath orchestrator to run and manage the process. It is used to run and manage the processes. Next is Blue Prism, this is also one of the popular platform, right? Blue Prism aims to provide automation that enterprises can use according to their needs. 
so obviously companies can use blue prism to automate their processes but one thing is they can automate their processes according to their needs blue prism aims to do this by how we can do this means so blue prism aims to do this by providing automation that is scalable configurable and centrally managed so lot of flexibility will be there in blue prism so that based on that we can create or we can automate our processes uh, right so mainly blue prism sells its software through its partners right some of the clients of blue prisms are accenture capgemini deloitte digital workforce right tcs techmahindra ibm and others and especially tautonomy and wipro okay next is work fusion work fusion also offers automation that is based on rpi and machine learning especially it concentrates on machine learning and work fusion delivers a software as a solution for automating high volume data if you uh, if you have high volume data and you need to automate uh, using the dry volume data you can go for work fusion and work fusion enables man and machine to work in tandem this is the special feature of work fusion so it allows both human and machine to work in tandem while managing optimizing and or op- automating the tasks next one is tautonomy tautonomy delivers software that helps automate business and it processes you can observe one thing here most of uh, the platforms is mainly concentrating on the business automation right most of the platforms and also that uh, autonomy uh, it will take help of blue prism it uses blue prism and other automation softwares and customizes it right so that autonomy mainly use blue prism to customize their softwares getting my point and the last platform is cofax so cofax capo rpi platform is capable of automating and delivering processes that are repetitive and rule based mainly if your uh, automated process is repetitive uh, suppose if you are making the process uh, repetitive process automated you are rule based you should go for cofax and cofax uses robots for extracting and consolidating information right and also the software platform that is cofax at for platform consists of management console to deploy to deploy and manage pods right yeah almost all the sub, uh, platforms have the particular uh, particular component to uh, deploy the pods in the same way cofax is also having management console to deploy and manage pods and also we can see the performance of the pods and and also there will be a monitoring system in cofax right and also one more specialty is this software this cofax can also group together high priority tasks that should be completed first by the robo during the times of high workload this is the special feature so you can select high priority tasks to be completed first during the uh, times of high workload okay that is the specialty of cofax software but one more dis- uh, disadvantage of cofax software is uh, it doesn't have any machine learning capabilities right so these are all the platforms that can be used to automate your processes so you can go for ui path studio you can go for blue prism right but uh, ui path studio and blue prism are more popular comparatively right compared to other platforms hope you are understanding the concept suppose if you have any doubts please post your doubts in the comment section thank you thank you for watching the video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and please don't forget to like the video and please don't forget to share the video with your friends your support means a lot thank you thank you for watching the video